Hello, welcome to a new episode, and today I'm going to do a different type of beer tasting, as you might have seen in the title. We got a, a versus match going on here. Um, what I wanted to do is I wanted to bring, I brought back all that beer from Colorado, and three of the cases had IPAs. So I wanted to take at least two of them, because I wasn't going to open up three beers, and kind of stack one against the other. So we're going to be tasting these for the first time and putting them up against each other. We've got the Breckenridge Hop Peak IPA. Uh, it says complex and aromatic with notes of citrus and pine. And then the second one is Pike's Peak Elephant Rock IPA, which uh, doesn't have a description on it exactly what it says. Um... But anyway, so we'll start with uh, the Pikes Peak since it's in my hand. 7.7% alcohol by volume, uh, brewed and canned by Pikes Peak Brewing in uh, Monument, Colorado. 12-ounce uh, can. It's a, nice, it's a nice plain can, elevating the craft of beer. Um, I kind of like their nice simple designs that they have on their cans. Uh, you know, the, the thing is about their cans is it's pretty much like the same except the uh, name of the beer is a little different you know well not a little different name of the beer is different from all the other beers and the cans would be different color but everything else on the can pretty much re remains the same so uh if you drink pike's peak brewing uh you can pretty much probably discern what you're drinking just by the color of the can okay so it smells like an ipa Looks like an IPA. It's a uh, hop forward. It smells good. It's it's an all around decent IPA. Um, I can't complain. It's not the greatest IPA that I've had, but it's it's all around a really good IPA. So I'm not going to get too heavy into the details with each of these, um, but this has a score of 83 on Beer Advocate, which is good. It's commendable. Um, I think it's, it's uh, a good choice for an IPA if you get the chance to uh, drink it. Um, you know, it's pretty good. I'm just going to go ahead and give it a score right now. Um, I'm going to give it uh, four beers out of six. All right. So that glass is gone. Now we'll move on to Breckenridge Brewery uh, Hot Peak IPA. Um, typically, you can't go wrong in my experience with Breckenridge Brewery. Again, this smells like an IPA. This smells a little bit more on the, when they say there's like pine, like notes of pine, you can pick that up. You can definitely pick that up in the smell. Looks, looks like an IPA should. That nice golden color. So, like I said, it's, it is hoppy, but very, very pine forward. All right, bottoms up. Ooh, that's very pine forward. Um, it's not bad. It's there's probably too much of that that aromatic pine taste going on so this on uh, beer advocate has a score of 87 so it's just slightly better uh, with their rankings of, of it than the Pikes Peak Elephant Rock um, but all it really takes for Elephant Rock is to get a little bit more higher scores uh, in on on the site and it could easily tie Hot Peak IPA um, 
it's bold. It's a bold IPA. If you like bold IPAs, um, and you know you like that pine stuff that's going on with it, then you know it's uh, obviously for you. But uh, for me, head to head, uh, giving the Hot Peak IPA from Breckenridge Brewery uh, a three out of six. Obviously, for me, the winner is the Pikes Peak Elephant Rock. IPA, but I'm gonna have to finish both of these. I, they're both they're both good. I would both I would buy both of them again, but if I saw them sitting side by side, and I had to choose one, I would get the Elephant Rock IPA all the way. So there you have it, the Pikes Peak Brewing Company Elephant Rock IPA versus the Breckenridge Brewery Hot Peak IPA head to head. In my opinion. Pikes Peak is the winner by just one beer bottle. By one beer bottle. Um, they're both very good beers, though. Congratulations to both you guys for making outstanding IPAs. So that's going to do it for today. If you're new here, please click subscribe. Click that like button down below or the dislike. I, Whatever, you know, doesn't hurt my feelings. And most importantly, share the content with your friends. And let me know below what your favorite IPA is. We'll see you guys next time.